Alright and welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode Season 2 We're going for episode 5 Above and Beyond Alright guys and welcome back So we're going for the final episode Episode 5 The final battle where Jesse's new enemy brings the battle home to Beacon Town and the world may never be the same. Alright, let's get this show on the road, shall we? Third episode five. And it's loading. Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. There is a key difference between a good friend and a bad one. Good friends do what you ask. They enjoy what you make for them. They never betray you. Jesse is a perfect example of what we call a bad friend. Other bad friends include, in no particular order, Fred and Zara. Ultimately, all losers who refuse to appreciate the gifts they've been given. Now me, I won't stand for ingratitude. So I took my gifts away. Oh, but then, then, just when I thought I'd found a promising new friend... <sighs> Such a disappointment. That is when I had a brilliant idea. The perfect way to weed out the bad friends from the good. To be appreciated. I became Jesse. I was right, of course. The plan worked immediately. Jesse's good friends flocked to me. Of a better Jesse. <sighs> and now poor Jesse is dead, having never learned her lesson. The saddest part of all, really, is that Jesse will never get to see how much better I've made Beacon Town. <laughs> Oh, yes! <laughs> I'm gonna kick your ass, Edwin. didn't think to fortify these tunnels into town. Speaking of fighting admins, I can't help but wish we still had Zara around. I know she was... well, she was a little much. But having an ex-admin on our side seems like it could have come in handy. Oof, I guess. She still scared me, though. She already helped us a lot. The portal, buying us time to get up here? Yeah. Yeah, I see what you mean. Uh, maybe Zara's lucky being where she is right now. She's not currently marching towards a fight with the Admin. I'm just glad that friends of Fred stayed at the entrance to that... that Heckmouth. This is far too dangerous for them. Yeah. Jesse, when Romeo finds out what we're trying to do, we've seen what he does. I don't want to end up like Fred. I don't want Beacon Town to be like Zara's town. We've seen so many terrible things that Romeo's done. I just can't even handle thinking about that happening to the others. To our home. Yes, things look impossible. And they might be. But I believe in all of us. Look how far we've come. Look at all the impossible we've already done. Yeah. We can do this. I know it seems hopeless, but we can't give up now. There are people up there counting on us. And we are not going to let them down. Hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Let's do it. Woo! My, that was loud. Hello. Here we go.
What do you guys want to bet that's where the primary terminal is? The giant floating tower with no clear entrance? Yeah, probably. We gotta find a way up there. Might be a good idea to hit the map shop. Regroup, get some supplies. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. Guys, admin! And... He's with Axel and Olivia. We gotta hide. Typical. Heading exactly where we wanted to go. Then I guess we just can't get caught. Why exactly are we having a whole festival devoted solely to you? Do we really have to go up on stage with you in front of everyone? Enough! You two are going to need to do a lot less talking and a lot more agreeing if you want to be a part of Beacon Town. Not so sure I do, actually. In fact, we were just about to head home. I'd be very careful if I were you guys, or there might not be a home to go back to at all. It's just so easy for something bad to happen to a town, like Champion City, for example. And... Boop. along and get that fireworks show ready for the big keynote, eh? Yes, admin. Uh, Jesse. I think the admin's distracted. Yeah. We should go grab Axel and Olivia while we have the chance. What? You were always so worried about Champion City, and now... Olivia! Axel! Oh my gosh! I knew it! I just knew it! <gasps> Whoa, am I seeing double? Shh! Jesse, I... What is... Come on, I'll explain everything. But we have to get off the streets. To the map shop, quick. to say admins a world beneath the bedrock yeah i still think you made that part up i mean i'm relieved that the jesse out there isn't the real you but but nobody else knows that what if everyone in beacon town turns on you i mean with what just happened outside axel and i almost did and we're your oldest friends i mean if we couldn't tell I... I'll just have to make them understand what happened. Make them? I suppose if anyone could make them listen, it'd be you. Yeah. I, you said there's a way to stop this guy, right? Petra. Stella sucks even when she's on our side, but nobody deserves that. Ever. Her whole city. Gone. In an instant. It's insane. Nobody should have that much power. Add it to the list of horrible things the admin's gonna pay for. Yeah, remember. I'm so glad you guys are okay. Did Jesse tell you about the potato yet? The what? 
In the underneath, we got our hands on something called a word of passage. Hashtag potato451. I know it sounds weird, but it's supposed to take away the admin's powers for good. Oh, I can't wait to see his face when that happens. Look at the state of my poor shop. I'm almost glad Nermi doesn't have to see the old girl looking like this. Is it even safe to hide out in here? <laughs> yeah, it used to be the safest place around. That was before the admin's goons were everywhere. It's been ransacked once. Whoever did that might come back again. <laughs> Comforting. Getting into that tower won't be easy. Hopefully, there's still something useful in here. Everyone, take a look around. Shout if you find anything. While you guys do that, I'm gonna keep watch. You okay there, Jack? Uh, fine, I guess. Just feeling a little violated at someone coming in here and robbing the place. Priceless artifacts and mementos gone. Everything ransacked. I don't know if it was the admin, looters, what I... Uh... I promise, Jack. We're going to get everything back once we defeat the admin. Yeah, you're right. Probably just fixating on this to distract myself. In the meantime, we'll keep looking around. Might be something useful in here yet. Uh, thanks, Jesse. I appreciate it. Anytime, bud. guys and thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it i really appreciate all the support you've given us uh please comment like and subscribe for more awesome content and please also check out all of these thumbnails around me for more fantastic content from projects all right all right and until the next time bye bye